systemic lupus erythematosus this condition systemic lupus erythematosus is an autoimmune connective tissue disorder in this condition females are more commonly affected than that of males and the ratio of 9 is to 1 and if uh, SLE occurs in males then they got very poor prognosis 100% renal involvement is seen in children with SLE and very strong familial history is present in patients of systemic lupus erythematosus and the genetic risk factors implicated are the HLA DRB03 HLA DB02, HLA DR3. And let's look into the environmental risk factors seen in patients of uh, SLE. OCP usage and hormone replacement therapy, UVB rays, Epstein Barr virus infection, smoking, silicosis, all these are found to be have the strong environmental risk factors for the SLE. And let's see the autoantibodies seen in the patients of SLE. Anti smooth antibodies, anti DS DNA antibodies, double standard DNA antibodies are seen in patients of systemic lupus erythematosus. Anti smooth antibodies is found to be the most specific type of auto antibodies for SLE. And in case of neuropsychiatric lupus, anti riposomal P protein are seen. And also, other investigations like ESR is a non specific elevation is seen. And also CRP, C-reactive protein, which is low in lupus. And complement like C3 and C4 also helps in the diagnosis. Let's look into the clinical features presented by the patients of systemic lupus erythematosus. Fever, fatigue, weight loss, malar rash, alopecia, that is hair loss, mucosal ulcer ulcers, arthritis or arthralgia, serositis, glomerular nephritis, Neuropsychiatric manifestations like depression, psychosis, peripheral neuropathy and also auto autoimmune cytopenia like conditions like anemia, thrombocytopenia or also or all the clinical features which can be seen in, cases of, in patients of systemic lupus erythematosus. In case of uh, the most specific is the malar rash which is a butterfly rash is seen in these patients. And we have seen all the clinical features and also investigation which help in the diagnosis of systemic lupus erythematosus. Let's look into the treatment plan which can be offered to these patients. In case of mild cases, oral steroids are given. In case of severe cases, IV steroids are given. And other drugs which are used in treatment of SLE are methotrexate, cyclophosphamide, hydroxychloroquine, mycophenital morphetine which is used in case of treating the resistant lupus and also calcineurin inhibitors. All these are the drugs which are used in treatment of SLE. In brief about the condition which is associated with other autoimmune disorders also and thank you for watching.